Salutations, my name is Ellie Hobine. I'm an eighth grader from Sco Middle School. <laughs> and I named this poem, It Didn't Mean to Be About You. <sighs> Intentional. I can't breathe anymore. The tension of air has gotten too thick as it creates a simple task to be ruined. Inhale and exhale, it doesn't go away. Maybe if I hold my breath, it will all float out. That makes my head dizzy as I have to inflate my lungs. Rejecting, it tries to push it out. Once you lose air, you have to breathe. So as I breathe and cough and breathe and cough, how can you breathe like there's nothing wrong? The air floats through your lungs as you smile and laugh with your friends. My eyes filled with stars as you grin, chatting away, basically forgetting my existence. Again, I stop inhaling, observing you, observing your cycle of breathing, trying to make mine better. I start to cry in defeat. The tears trickle from my eyes, falling into my mouth as they pass. You're standing beside me, talking with other friends around me. You can't see the tears as you can only see the smile, the big, fat, ugly smile, and you believe it all, trying to rub your own happiness on me. Then you walk away. I want to claw towards you, but instead I sway, my face turning purple away from my friends, away from you. I breathe in once more, like I was breathing in sand. I tried to cough it out, the sharp rocks rubbing against my throat, causing it to burn. Closing my mouth quickly, my heart rate slowly decreases. Starting at 110, it descends. 109, 108, 107, 106, 105. I don't want to breathe like there's something wrong with me. I want to breathe like a normal person, just like you. Instead, I breathe as if a pillow were being pushed on my mouth, flailing my arms into the air as I panic. I can't complete simple tasks without breaking into a cough. For you, it's so effortless, as you do it without thinking. How do you do that so easily? How do you breathe the air as if it has no toxins, no chemicals? You breathe in the good air and leave the bad air for me, exhaling my inhale. It doesn't make sense anymore as it makes my head hurt, my hands clench, my toes curl, my heart rate increase, my mouth go dry. I forgot to breathe. What happens when you forget to breathe? Your world turns black, mixed with specks of white as you crash towards the floor. My eyes gloss over once opened. Maybe my lungs don't like the air. They refuse as they try to push it out. But there was this one day I finally talked to you instead of watching from afar. That was the first day I could finally breathe without coughing it all out, without holding my breath to see if it'll just all dissipate. You can be my oxygen. I will just be your carbon dioxide. Energy.